What's up YouTube, it's your boy Chris coming to you once again. And this is going to be a little bit different for me. On my channel, I have it in the description on my channel. You can click on it saying it'll be more college vlogs with the little projects added into it. Well today, I got a little bit of a project to do. Today I'm going to be blacking out my Chevrolet emblem. This baby right here. And let's walk back here, blacking out these two. And no, I will not do the tail lights because it came out terrible last time I did it. But anyway, and I bet you're asking, why you want to black these out? Well, to me, they give more of a better look to the vehicle. And plus, I just think they just look freaking badass, I should say. <laughs> Uh, I did have this plastic dip actually twice before, but it didn't really come out as well as I wanted to. So I ended up taking it off. So, and as for this one back here, these two, especially this one, this was literally a pain to get off. Believe me, when I said that was a pain, that was a pain to get off. And then trying to get all that plastic dip right here and out of here. It was just like, God, I hate that. But I think I have a way to kind of, kind of eliminate that. And that is put tape in between here. Uh, hopefully in here without messing it up. And then probably right here. And I'll probably max this off in case of overspray. And I'll probably put tape in here. And this one's really not that bad, but I just gotta mask this part off. It's pretty much this whole thing. Sorry. <laughs> Whoops. This whole thing right here. All this to keep from overspray. So if you just give me a sec, I'm gonna mask, well, clean it off first. Then I'll mask it off. And then I'll come back to you guys later. Okay, so what you wanna do is take your favorite glass cleaner. Um, I got Windex, has some other stuff in there, but I didn't feel like getting that out. This was the closest thing I had. Give it a quick shake, and I'm, if, as you can tell, I'm using my left hand. I got this in my right hand. Ah, insulation. So what you want to do is just, just spray that off, and then take yourself a microfiber, microfiber cloth and just clean that off. Just clean it off. Remove any dirt or any bugs off. Now just do the same thing here. And here. And yes, I know the car is dirty, gotta wash it. But being in school four days a week and doing all the work, yeah, it's kind of hard. So, <laughs> all right, guys, here's the finished product. Looks pretty neat, doesn't it? No overspray anywhere. Now, if you see any little black spots, obviously the camera's not going to pick it up. It's because I had a little bit of overspray and plus one day. I guess you can see the black spots there. But yeah, anyway, um, it was windy one day and that was the only day I can really do it because the next week it's gonna rain and plus we didn't have this garage here at the time two years ago, so yeah. Now, as for the other side, check that out. That looks pretty sick, doesn't it? I love how this turned out, I really do. Now, if you notice here, I didn't get the chance to do that one. And that's because I ran out of tape. So I'm gonna have to go buy some tape here one day next week or so and get that plastic dip and show you all the finished product. But yeah, that's how that looks. And you see a little bit, a little bit of a black spot. Some of the plastic decided to drip off the tape, so. And no, I didn't use too much of it. But yeah, 
Um, I really like it. And I hope to keep this thing on for a long time. I hear nice shade looks a lot better, but I don't know. I have to buy it for myself and see. Oh, one more thing. As for the tail lights are concerned, I may just go ahead and buy some nice shade with it. Um, and if you see a little bit of black stuff on it, that's when I had to had to had to think plasti dip. And unfortunately, I did three coats of that stuff. God, I'm supposed to hate it. It's dark enough. I'm supposed to go any further than that. No. That's not the case. I flipped the hazards on one day. Turned them on. Oh, it was, it was ugly. My goodness. You talk about ugly. But yeah, I'll catch up with you guys later.